Welcome back to Warp Reacts. Um, oh, yeah. Folks, the folks uh, that listened to our Sound of Silence battle that we just finished here recently, they kept asking. The vast, there were several versions asked for other than the six that we chose. But one kept getting asked for more often than the others, and it was the Dan Vask version. The and vast those, majority? The, I hate you. Um <laughs> The vast majority of them, yes. Uh, so uh, they are big supporters of us, uh, as are many others. But we're gonna we're gonna focus on Dan Vask today, um, and I, I figured it'd be a good idea to appease them. Hmm. And it's not like I don't like the sound of silence. And Dan Vask has impressed us the last two occasions that we've listened to him. So what are the odds he's not going to do it again? I say pretty slim. Hmm. Anyway, without any further nonsense. Oh, look, you're no fun. Oh, wait. I forgot the other part. Nonsense? Please, well, please like, comment, subscribe, share with others. Please join us That's not nonsense. for a lot of nonsense and shenanigans at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time every Sunday, including Christmas Eve. That's right. It's a hoot. It, it's a uh, hoot nanny. Okay, we're ridiculous. Here we go. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again because a vision softly. done this to me before so i'm not going to mm -hmm. jump to any conclusions that he's just going to do a nice clean version with nah, he can get into it, it. it. yeah get into it. i okay. almost I, I go ahead i want him to i really want him to but to almost, do the nice clean version i yes i want him to do the nice clean version like right. how he's doing it right. just to just to see but in my head but in my head, I'm like, <laughs> at some point, he's gonna like just metal the he's shit gonna, out of this. He's phone. gonna grab that mic <laughs> and just metal the shit out of this whole song. Right. All right, here we go. In restless strings, I walked along narrow streets of cobblestone, neath the halo of a street light. I turn my color to the cold and damp When my eyes were stabbed by the flash of a neon light That split the night And touched the sound of silence and mm -hmm. I, 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 I... Yeah, he's going to pick it up here a little, but this is where it normally picks up in the song anyways. Mm -hmm. I really thought that maybe he was going to do what Bobby Bass did, which was maybe sort of follow the track of Disturbed. And he's not. Mm -hmm. And I like that. I like that because, well, Disturbed's version is very, it's very easy to cover that cover. Hmm. It's so, easy to cover. It's easy to get the anger part of it out. Right. It, where Disturbed did that very well. I think he is, I almost want to say he's very Jeff. In this version, where Jeff kind of had that monotone, yeah, yeah, perhaps I don't know about um, monotone, but I know what you're saying. You, you know what I mean? That's that single track, right? Right. Um, which, again, is a great way to do this song. I, I want to see him kind of dan it up a little bit, though. I yeah, definitely oh, want to see him dan it up. And for those of you who hate interruptions, we're sorry, but that's the type of reaction that we are. And Deal with it. Butcher said to me earlier tonight, he said, "Sorry, not sorry." Did I say that? Well, I'm sure you thought it. 
I definitely thought it, but I don't remember saying it. All right, here we go. It need a naked light, I saw. Two thousand people, maybe even more. People talking with a house became. People hearing. He's ready to go. It's a good face. It's yeah. Good face. Well, yeah, he's definitely he's uh I don't know if I would call this Dan Vasking it up though. I don't think he's not Dan Vasking it up, but I think you hit it. And I mean that in a compliment. The pun. I don't I don't mean that in a yeah, negative no, that's right. not a bad thing. Pardon the pun, but I think you you hit a chord when I, I'm starting to feel more of that disturbed version. That is also what I'm I'm picking I'm up. I'm feeling too. I'm feeling more of that disturbed version. He started off here. And you can feel the anger kind of building. Well, he's he's also got the boom boom of the bass drums in the in the background, like in the disturbed version. Yeah. So that's yeah. He's not doing any. He's not going down into the minor key or minor minor notes over versus major notes. Like he's staying in the major notes, as most people do, as opposed to disturbed when there's a place to go into the minor key. That's what Dave and Draymond does. What? Yeah. Fletcher, no. You have something on your face that says you want to say something. He froze for me for a moment. Oh, that sucks. Did I at least my audio come through? Yeah, that's your audio was there. Well, that's the most important. Nobody wants to see my face. Here we go. Hell the people bother Was, that was, was there a layered? Was that layered? There was a layered in there? Yeah, it was. Layered. I swear to God, that was okay. David Draymond. Well, sure. Like, sure. But I, I'm wondering if, it, if that was a layer or it's possible that he might have been uh, multitonal there. I'm not sure. That was. You know how Deanna is? Yeah, that okay. was epic. That was awesome. Yes, that absolutely Go. was. That was that was incredible. Um, I look. This is not. I'm not trying to take anything away from him, you Dan Vask fans. It was very, very reminiscent of David Draymond's version from Disturbed. I yeah. think that the, the music track, if not the exact track, was very almost almost the exact same track that Disturbed uses. So that's what it, it's it very much sounded like that, especially during the higher parts there, or the or not the higher parts, the more intense parts. Right. Um, I loved it. I absolutely loved it. Um, and it, I mean, it's definitely a great cover. I, I'm surprised that somebody can sound that close to David Draymond and not be 
David Draymond. That's so. that's why I stopped it in the middle there because it was when he hit that multi tonal whatever you want to call it. Right. I was like, stop, Polly because Polly. it was like Polly. that was literally just listening. It's like if you were to put them two next to each other at that point. At that point, um, yeah, you might have been confused. You might have been like, wait, which one is that? Yep. Because it was that close. Yep. Uh, the the version was awesome. I, I yep. mean, I like Dan Vask a lot. I like how the biggest thing with him is I love how he keeps his videos simple. It's just him, black screen, microphone, maybe a guitar. That's yeah. it. Um, um, I'm sorry, go ahead. No, I just I I think this was a great cover. I think it was an amazing cover, an amazing job. Butcher. I I also like how uh, his videos are very simple. It it keeps the focus of the video on him. There's not not crazy effects going on. He's yep. earning his viewers through the quality of his music. Right, and that's great. That's great. Um, the version itself is is a good version. It's a good right. version. Like you said, it bore a lot of striking resemblances to Disturbed. So right. while I definitely like the, this version, um, I'm kind of like, I got to scratch my head at that, whatever. Dan has a great voice. Yeah. He's extremely versatile. He can go from like that operatic, you know, Broadway stuff to right. to heavy metal. And he he showed his range. In yeah, that he's way got an impressive song. range. Yeah. So yeah, yeah it, was, it was cool. It was cool. Yeah. Um, I would say this for those who are wondering where I would place it if if it had made it into the Sound of Silence battle, I'd put it second place behind Disturbs. Uh, that was what I would put it. Um, but I'd actually tie it. I would, would actually you? I would tie it. I would tie it with Disturbs version. It would have to be a tie. I mean, if Disturbs version didn't exist, I'd say that it it would be my first place in that battle. Um, but anyways. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, we hope that you appreciate this video, this uh, reaction video. Uh, we are big-time fans of Dan Vasquez, and we're going to continue to react. Actually, we have one coming up for um, New Year's. I want to say it's for New Year's Eve or New Year's – around New Year's time, that's a Dan Vask, um video. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the buttons. Uh, hit the buttons. 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time every Sunday, including Christmas Eve. We do a live show where we are much nicer to one another. And Ogre likes a vast majority of I hate stuff. you. I, I do not like you. Bye-bye!